The Memphis Grizzlies have won four of their last five games since the return of John Morant. They'll travel to Los Angeles to face a Clippers team that's won 10 of their last 12 overall. And we're here to break it down for you guys from a sports betting point of view. I'll give you guys my pick and my prediction in the game. This is Steve Seagrave from SportsMemo.com. I also have a promo code to give you guys at the end of the video. But for now, if you guys could hit the like button, subscribe to the channel, hit the bell, and let us know in the comment section, who do you guys have in this one? Side, total, player prop, you name it. We'd love to hear from you guys, so let us know in the comment section. So looking at the Wager Talk Live Odds screen, Clippers, 7-point home favorites total sits at 225.5. Clippers, 18-12 and 12 on the year, have really come into form and gelled. Harden's been there for a while now, but they've been strong since he was added to the team. Grizzlies only 10 and 20. You know, obviously the Morant suspension really set the season back for them, and they're really digging themselves out of a hole now. Injury is going to be a big story in this one. As usual in the NBA, the injury report, the first thing you got to check. Kawhi Leonard questionable with a hip for the Clippers. I, If I had to guess, I don't think he's playing in this game. He's missed some time. And it, it seems like from the reports that he's going to be missing this game. Grizz, big one. John Morant uh, missed last night's game against Denver with an illness. I would expect him to return tonight. Uh, you know, second game of a back-to-back. -back. He missed last night's game. So I'd expect him to return tonight. Derek Rose and Luke Kennard, also questionable for the Grizz. Like I said, the Clippers, they've been clicking. Especially at home, they're strong. 12-4 and four straight up at home this season. 12th in defensive rating, and 10 and 2 in their last 12. They've been clicking, uh, lost a couple of games recently. But the big thing here is without Kawhi, without Leonard, if he's if he's missing in this game, obviously it goes without saying it's a big loss for the Clippers. Grizz, 29th on the year in offensive rating. Big part of that was missing Morant. You know, obviously they're going to improve with him in the lineup. They've been played a lot of, lot better since he's returned, and their only loss has been last night against Denver without Morant in the lineup. 142-105, they got blown out in Denver. But the good news for tonight is that Morant didn't play, Rose didn't play, Kennard didn't play. Morant should return and maybe some of the other guys as well. And also, nobody last night for the Grizz played more than 30 minutes based on the blowout. So actually, it's a back-to-back, -back, but they're not really playing. They didn't really play full minutes last night and this team they're, they're playing with a sense of urgency right now they need every win they can get to make the playing tournament at this point they're 10 and 20 it's going to be a long stretch here for them to get back to 500 and uh like, like yeah like they, they need every win they can get to make this playing tournament guys use the code holiday seven you get a seven day all access pass only 69 dollars less than 10 dollars a day and i'm running hot right now 9-1 overall, my last 10 plays, 23-12 December hoops. And if you're watching this video before 3 p.m., I have a 5% Liberty Bowl play, 10-4 in the college football season. Kept it low volume, and it really worked out. But I'm running hot recently, doing really well, 9-1 in my last 10. Use the code HOLIDAY7. You can use it for anyone on the site, Sports Memo, or Wager Talk, and get a 7-day all-access pass for $69. Get the plays right when they come out. Get the best of the number and get your action in there. Looking at the official play for this one, I'm expecting Kawhi Leonard not to play. I'm expecting a big effort from the Grizzlies in this one. I do think the Clippers win outright, but I'll take the seven points with the Grizz on the road. They, with I think Morant's playing tonight, so I'll take Grizz plus seven. Desperation keeps it close for them tonight in Los Angeles. Let us know who you guys like in the comment section. Good luck, guys, and I'll see you next video.